from deep inside the Thomas Edison National Historical Park, the West Orange Patch presents Edison Unveiled. Hi, my name is Carmen. I'm one of the park rangers here at Thomas Edison National Historical Park. And today we are in Building 5, which is the heavy machine shop. Okay, we're standing right in front of the radial drill press. The interesting thing about this machine is that it moves in many different directions. The drill bit moves back and forth. The whole head can actually move around to over here in this area. And the whole head can actually tilt at different angles. The other neat thing about this machine is the floorboards right in front here actually can come on up if they're working with large pieces of metal. So how is this place all powered? Well, take a look right behind me and you'll see those two large motors that are up there. One's a 35, one's a 40 horsepower motor. And if you notice those belts that run on down, powering those two large line shafts on each side that powers each one of these machines. Just imagine what it would have been like to work in this machine shop with the flatbed planers running, the radial drill press, the center boring machine, the milling machines, the lathes. This place had to have been deafening. Here we're standing in front of one of the machinist toolboxes and these were very important to the machinists themselves because this was their life. Their ultimate goal was to actually own their own machine shop and they would move from one machine shop to another, learning skills, passing on skills, but ultimately their goal to own their own machine shop. Thank you for your short time here at the Thomas Edison National Historical Park. We look forward to you coming out to our park, visiting the heavy machine shop, and learning what it would have been like to work for Thomas Edison. <laughs>